and welcome to Thursday's Daily Financial Digest. Here's what's making headlines in the markets today. The Aussie yen currency pair has seen a sharp plunge in the last sessions to two-year lows amid growing political turmoil. Trade Minister Liam Fox said there is a 50-50 chance that Brexit may be stopped if Parliament rejects the government's divorce deal. Commodity traders are in the dark due to the U.S. government shutdown, unable to obtain clues as to whether China is buying grain and soy. The euro-dollar pair has lost 0.1% in the last session. The RSI is giving a negative signal. The price of gold has traded sideways in the last session. The stochastic RSI is giving a negative signal. The dollar-yen pair continues to plunge, shedding 0.5% in the last session. The ATR swings into high volatility. The Aussie dollar pair has shown slight gains in recent sessions, up 0.4% in the last session. The RSI enters the positive area. The U.S. ISM manufacturing PMI will be released at 1,500 GMT. The Eurozone's private loans at 900 GMT. The U.K. PMI construction at 930 GMT. The U.S. ADP employment change at 1,315 GMT. The U.S. ISM prices paid at 1,500 GMT. And the U.S. EPI weekly crude oil stock at 2,130 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Thursday's Market Outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.